Alright people, welcome back to some more Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Plays, more Yu-Gi-Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. So, hopefully, uh, this w method of getting the video perfect works. So, uh, last week we did both methods. We lowered the quality on OBS, and I don't believe too much terrible happened, but what really worked and seemed to work, uh, and what we're probably going to stick with is Camtasia. Camtasia has always been my go-to recording system. And it seems like it works as long as the first audio and secondary audio don't get out of sync. But it seems like the longer my computer is on, the longer, the more things that the computer has up, that it, the worse the recording gets. So what I do when I, it's time to go ahead and record some Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Face, some Legacy of the Duelist, I literally just restart my computer, shut it down, shut it, uh, turn it back on. And it's nice and re, uh, reset, which is it's nice and fresh. Nothing is open, no internet, no multiple tabs, no nothing. It's just Camtasia, Legacy of the Duelist, record, get that over with, and get that nice and good. So uh, anyway, welcome back. So I hope you guys are enjoying the series, enjoying the content on the channel. Yu-Gi-Oh! to Draft League Season 2 started. So you're pretty much getting uploads from me every single day. So uh, I hope that I hate am a channel worth subscribing to in your opinion so uh sit back relax and enjoy so uh more legacy of the duelist so we only got a couple more duels i mean we got plenty of duels in the game but before we switch over games to either duelist of the rollers or some duel links because i know some people want me to try out duel links i do have a method of recording uh on my phone so we can go ahead and do that but we got yugi versus my uh looks like joey versus i want to say that's bandit keith uh, Yugi versus Joey, or the Pharaoh versus Joey, and then I believe it's this is the finale, but I'm not sure if this, this, or this is the finale, because uh, this looks like little Yugi versus, I think that's Bandit Keith, so I'm not sure if that counts. I think the finale is just Yugi versus uh, Pegasus, but uh, yeah. And then we're gonna go ahead and hop in, hop to another Yu-Gi-Oh! Let's Play game. Doesn't mean that we're done with Legacy of the Duelist, definitely not. This game is a lot of fun, and we will be coming back to it, but yeah. Anyway, let's go ahead and do the duel of uh, the Pharaoh versus Mai. The time has come for Duelist Kingdom Tournament Finals, and Yugi and Joey were more than ready. I sure hope I'm doing the right thing and deciding du and deciding duel again with Grandpa's soul at stake. I have to. Yugi and Joey walked to the arena and met with the two other finalists, Mai and Bandit Keith. So what Bandit Keith? Like I thought. I mean, just his his silhouette looked like Bandit Keith. Benny Keith had cheated his way into the finals and had no plans to stop. See, like, right after it's the Pharaoh versus Pegasus, then it's Yugi versus Benny Keith. I don't remember that duel happening. I don't know. I don't know. Like, I believe that Benny Keith got kicked off the island when he tried to attack Pegasus before Yugi duel Pegasus, but I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, we'll find out. Uh, Yugi, Joey, Mai, and Bandit Keith, I welcome all of you to the playoff arena. Here is where the last great duel monsters duel shall be waged to determine the championship of the Duelist Kingdom. Only one of you shall emerge victorious. Only one of you shall win the three million dollar prize. That's a lot of money. Yeah. <laughs> three million with three million dollars to Pegasus. Pegasus, that's a life changing amount of money for normal people. <laughs> and of course, the victor in the playoffs shall earn the right to challenge me in the final match. Like, no one cares. Give me that $3 million, my boy. Like, shit. Like, I'm gonna win a YCS or top of, uh, or win Nats or win Worlds. $3 million, my boy. It's the freaking Konami gave out that kind of money, that kind of prize money. <laughs> the victor will be granted one request, whatever his or her heart most desires. And if it Within my vast power to do so, the wish will be granted. Okay, well, I guess if you be Pegasus and you get anything, so I guess I don't know. I don't know. Like, can I get four million dollars <laughs> if I beat you? All right. The victor will also be declared the undisputed Duelist Kingdom champion, ranked number one in the world. And and boys, that will be me. Mm hmm. Sure. <laughs> Surely any Duelist that has come this far must realize that the title. And not the money. It's the real prize. Is that not so? No, no, definitely the money. I'm playing a freaking children's card game here. Give me that money. <laughs> You're a regular comedian. <laughs> the money's all I need for my sister's operation. Yes, yes, I'm sure more. some of you have more riding on this tournament than others. Right, Yugi? So, did Joey spend the entire all the money on his sister's surgery because three million seems like a lot for a surgery like i don't know yeah i don't know i don't know but three million sounds like a lot <laughs> you captured my my grandpa's soul and mokuba and even settle settle kaiba captive 
but I'll find a way to defeat you and save them all. I'm interested. I'm, I'm, it's not interesting that I didn't play as Kaiba in Duel against Pegasus. I mean, it's interesting that I didn't have that in the game to do. This, the first semi-final match was Yugi versus Mai. Although Mai was now friends with Yuki, she was planning to win. I used to think the only person a duelist could trust was herself. Everyone else was just an opponent. Then I met Yugi, and I learned through him that even the strongest opponents in the arena could still be friends outside it. Yeah, yeah. If he hadn't loaned me his star trips, I might never even had it made it to the final round. I owe him a very great debt. I promised Yugi an honorable duel, and that's just what I'm going to give him. But if he thinks that means I'm going to battle, that means I'm not going to battle out, out. He's dreaming. Good. All right. Yeah, bring it, bitch. <laughs> I'm gonna give this bitch everything I got, so when you guys down, it'll be a victory I can be proud of. I promise him an honorable duel, not an easy one. Sounds good. Sounds good. I mean, you lost to fucking Taya, so if I lose to you, I might as well just go ahead and just commit seppuku right now, so. Alright, I will go second, because I want to attack first and get that additional card draw. I mean, just going second is just overall better, unless she can set up defense, uh, some good defense. Oh, is this a banned card I see? Uh, it's not even a rod yet. <laughs> uh, it's tough to face up, though. Wow, why does Mike just go on the defensive so early? She loves doing that. Well, I guess I'll go ahead and, uh, summon the Celtic Guardian. This opening hand is not the greatest. Like, this hand just looks like a classic Yu-Gi-Oh hand. Like, <laughs> it's got a banned card, some normal monsters that don't really do much. Freaking, you know, a ritual for, uh, a normal ritual monster. Polly when I got nothing to fuse, Swords of Veiling Light. Like, oh yeah, yeah, this is definitely, definitely a, uh, uh, a OG Yu-Gi-Oh hand. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, oh, yep, yep, here we go. Yep. Yep. Can the monster attack? I believe it can. Yep. Wow. And then she busts out Harpy's pet dragon already. Like, wow. Like, didn't she open up? Wow. And all that gives another fucking Celtic guardian? Like, what is this opening hand? <laughs> like, the best thing I could do would be to brain control and then, you know, it's to, uh, you can add one Harpy from your deck. Yeah. So that, that would even be a search. I mean, can I change battle position? What? I, it's been a while since I see Brain Control from the band. I don't know, I talked to one page, I don't know, I control, take control of it until the end page is turned. So I can play Brain Control, snatch up your Harpy, use Pet Dragon, and then run over your Harpy, Harpy Lady, and then I can play Swords of Reveal and Light. That wouldn't be terrible. Be like the best play I have right now. Uh, be nice if I could like keep it permanently or, you know, tribute it all, but. Oh, come on. Wow. She just has everything. I mean, it was still your card, but damn. She has Mirror Wall. She has fucking everything. Like, how come you went easy on fucking Taya and then you don't go and beat my ass and I'm fucking Yugi? Like, all right. All right, bitch. All right. Ah, uh, I don't even know how I'm going to deal with that. I, like, I literally need to get something to destroy this Mirror Wall or something. <laughs> Maybe I can hold out and she'll keep paying. Yep, it's Harpy Channel. Like, I really want to kill this freaking Harpy Channel. Wow, alright. Another Harpy's Pet Dragon? Yep, awesome. Awesome. Great, great, great. <laughs> more defensive cards. I got the defense. So that's this. I got a couple more turns. So they're being light. You want to keep the, no, you want to keep the mirror wall? Please, please keep the mirror wall. Less life points you have, the better, because I'm getting wrecked right now. No, oh my god, I shouldn't have set the spellbinding circle. Holy crap, that's annoying. No, oh, well, there's, if that goes to soldier, the problem is that fucking mirror wall, like, I'm, there's, I'll wait for her to either keep paying me or while I turn it off, and then I can summon BLS. And by BLS, I mean Black Luster Soldier, the OG original, uh, uh, ritual monster. Okay, she just read it now. That she's gonna maybe get one more turn out of it? Oh, nope. Damn, yep, there she goes again. One heart piece. 
Damn, she's got a freaking Hypey, Hypey Lady Phoenix formation too? Like, they give her all of her new cards. Alright, that's three for Swords. Alright, up well, it is time to bust out Black Cluster Soldier, really. No, oh my god. Fuck you, freaking Spellbind. Like, I can't wait to activate you. Struggle with monster you control that's owned by you. Alright, if that monster is still in the field, shuffle it. And your entire hand, after that, like, I kind of want to read this card, because I kind of feel like it's a piece of crap. It's better than the show. Holy crap. All right. Target one monster you control that is owned by you. Okay. That monster is still in the field. Shuffle it in your entire hand. Also that, draw cards equal to the number of cards you shuffled from your hand into the deck. When it's effect, you cannot activate this card if you have a card in your hand that is owned by your opponent. Okay, so I, it's just a weird kind of shuffle my hand back. And I got to send a monster control. So that's like a neg, but... Ugh. Oh, well, these guys got to be flipped up. Oh, wait, that's not eight. Oh, shit. All right, well, I am in deep shit. I was like, oh, I'm going to summon BLS. No, you ain't. You, I, just, I didn't know the Silver Fang was a three. Like, three, four. A great. Great. 22, 16. She's a 14 booty. And the strongest I can summon is 14. 29. Like, I, I think I'm fucked. I think I'm fucked. My got literally everything, and I got fucking nothing. Like, do you want me to use monster recovery and just shuffle all my shit back? At this point, that's really all I have. No. Like, maybe give me your Becky? I got Mirror Force. I got Mirror Force. Use your cards. Activate the effect. No, stop. It's like a little spell in the circle. Alright, so. Play dumb. Going defensive. I believe in the heart of the cards drew Mirror Force, so I'm gonna hit you with this good good. Alright, turn that to attack mode and catch this Mirror Force. Catch me outside, how about that? Alright? No. No. Oh my god, Spellbinding Circle, kill me now. Yep, more Harpy Lady shit. Look at Eagle Tiss, some more Harpy Lady. Alright, turn this to attack mode, go on the offensive. No, she's still leaving the defense mode, alright. It's not a terrible idea. You can catch this mirror force, my. Ah, yes. No. No, I'm gonna fucking take this card off the field and rip it in half. Holy shit, that's annoying. No. Shit. Is there like a button I can hold down similar to like YGO Pro? Holy crap. Wow, now I would like that Polly. <laughs> like, it's always just a combination of what I don't have. So she's 16. Alright, so. I'll tribute summon. Curse of Dragon. See, I just. All I had to do is believe in the heart of the cards to get that mirror force, my boy. That's all I needed. No. Holy crap. Spellbinding circle so annoying. Attack. Alright, oh, I am back in control of this duel. That's nice. It's one of your opponent's monsters, right? Yeah, good. So it won't keep asking me because my opponent doesn't even have a monster. Oh, she said a monster. I mean, Spellbinding so Circle is going to go off like crazy. It's going to be like, hey, 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 she got monsters. I know it's face down. Wow, bring control again. Hitting all these banned cards. Oh, uh, this only targets a face up card, right? Yeah, so. It's not like I can bring control her monster and, you know, attack. No, just attack. You know, tribute it off for, like, Catapult Turn or something. Ugh. Alright, my has no monsters, so it can stop asking me for a little while. Oh my god. No, oh, there's Polly. Well, I could fuse now, but I kind of don't want to. Like, that would be a neg on my part, I mean, just to get a little bit stronger. Like, I'm already in a fine position. It's just like, yay, I get to go to a... What is... What is... Uh, Gaia Dragon... Uh, Gaia Dragon Champion. What is that? 20... 26? 20... 27? I think he's 26. Oh, oh, no, no, yeah, 26. Like, nah. Let me, let me go ahead and fucking neg two. With, when I already have the Cursed Dragon, I'm already kicking butt with it just to get, what, 300 more attacks than regular Gaia? Like, the, it definitely has its uses. Like, if these two are in my hand, hell yeah. Because, I mean, it's not like I'm a tribute summon. I, I would neg more just tribute summoning to summon both of them than just go ahead and pawn them from my hand. 
That's one of the great benefits. But outside of that, yeah. All right, there, my. I beat you with the power of mirror force. <laughs> you got the tits. Literally, you had the tits. But I believed in the heart of the card. Shuffled my hand back. Took a double neg just to get a fucking mirror force. Well, I had nothing better to do. I had to believe in the heart of the cards again. Like God, this game literally just gives you exactly what you need at the right moment. Wait, my. There's something I want to say. Huh? Thank you. You said adults can learn more from defeat than victory, and you were correct. But you, my. You taught me a lot more today. I had to confront my fears and weaknesses, and I could, I could never have defeated you if I didn't shuffle my entire hand back and top deck that near for us. <laughs> it's awfully nice of you to say that, but it seems to me I also have a lot more to learn about dueling and about myself. And then I suppose no duelist ever learns all there is to know. Sappy shit, sappy shit right here. And maybe the most important lesson is that defeat doesn't have to be forever. You won this duel, Yugi, but there's there'll be others. You and I will meet in the arena again, kiddo. And when we do, you better watch out. Oh my god, sappy. <laughs> oh, oh, I'm gonna feel like I'm gonna throw up and gag me. Alright, alright, we're done. Thank you. Alright, so next time we're gonna be du playing uh, Joey, dueling against Vandy Keith, and then that and that. So we got about this week and the next week. And then the week after that, we'll go ahead and hop into another. Uh, do your let's play. Say it's either gonna be Duels of the Reds on a PS2 emulator. Shh, don't, don't, don't. I mean, how else would I record it? It's on PS2, you know. Yeah, so PS2 emulator, uh, or we're gonna be playing Duel Links, you know, because I have a oh, way of recording on my phone. I would have to get that for Duel Links first, but yeah. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed this uh, episode of Yu Gi Oh! Let's Play's Yu Gi Oh! Legacy of the Duelist. Thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys next time with some more. All right, people, thanks for watching.